Hello YouTube, this is Alex back with a follow-up to my video yesterday on picking um, tubular locks or ace locks. Uh, Wadasi2 commented that he had never single pin picked one, so I thought I'd show him uh, my technique for what it's worth. So the first thing I did was set up a uh, my Southord um, pick um, for this particular lock um, so that if I get it halfway open and can't get it any further, I can undo it. So there it is operating with the key. This is a switch lock, electronic switch lock. And then here it is just to validate that the pick functions. There it goes. You can see it turns around. Okay, so this is an old pick that I made. Let's see the close up of it for you. There, it's a pretty good shot. It's just a piece of wiper insert. It's cut to a little notch, kind of like a Pearson pry bar. All right, back to there, good. And this guy sits right here. Just happened to fit very nicely. And I'm just gonna apply sort of enough tension to keep it from moving around. And then I have uh, one of my many broken old picks. So we apply a little tension and then we simply um, do our normal thing of try to locate pins that are binding. Challenges with these things can be that the springs are different strengths to actually prevent certain types of picking and impressioning. It's a little tricky sometimes to judge whether something is binding or just on a tough spring. There we are, finally. So I'm gonna actually move this all the way. First I'm gonna take this out very carefully so you can see that it's picked in fact. God help me, I hope this thing's still rolling and in frame, yes indeed. So that is picked, single pin picked. Um, now what you'll see is if I turn it um, to here, you can hear it lock up again. And that's because all the little pin chambers just pop back down on the top springs, but luckily I have my, this tool to hopefully, there it is, clear it back to one of the positions where the key can run it. So I would say not a terribly easy pick, but not super hard. Um, it seemed like it took me about four takes to get it in a reasonable amount of time. Um, again, can be a little harder because the springs have varying tensions and there do tend to be some sort of security features on the pins depending on the lock. But anyway, uh, if you're bored and you want to open one of these things, it's good fun. And it is kind of cool because you can see the pins moving about as you set and overset and change tension, things like that. So it would be kind of a cool learning experience. Anyway, this is Alex. Ace lock, single pin picked for my good friend Wada C2. Check out uklocksport.co.uk for other great picking information and lots of good good uh, people. Have fun and keep it legal. Thanks.